Welcome to Bad Food Blog. And today I have two things. I have <clears throat> this Feasters cheeseburger, one pound. This is an Asda only uh, rustlers kind of uh, creation. And I'm also going to be reviewing the British turkey and stuffing pasties. These are mini pasties. And uh, obviously I know this is a fairly strange lunch, but uh, they're both running out of date soon. This one today and I need to eat it. And this is what I actually wanted to have for dinner. So, well, I don't actually want to have this for dinner, but I thought I might as well try it. And look, it's a Christmas jumper. It's a T-Rex breathing lightning whilst wearing a Santa hat. I think that constitutes Christmas, right? Okay, so let's start by getting these ready. First thing to do, let's get the burger buns in the toaster. And the burger itself, which has these lines on, see those? Onto a plate. And I will be placing that in the microwave for 1 minute and 20 seconds. I already read the packaging, and now I'm not confident. Yeah, 1 minute 20. There we go. Whilst that is cooking for 1 minute 20 seconds, let's have a taste of one of these. So, we have the standard mini pasty configuration going on here. A little bit of mini crimping on the top. Feels very hollow. Makes kind of a hollow sound and uh... Mmm! Remind me more of sausage rolls than the pasties because the... The... <coughs> the pasty bit in the middle... <coughs> appears to be more like a sausage paste. Oh, wow, it's done something to my throat. Hmm. But very Moorish. <clears throat> they are ready to eat, but you can heat them in the oven. Hmm. Hmm. They're very dry. Obviously turkey's quite a dry meat. So the person who cooked this one. Wow. That is like chalk. Okay. This is dry as hell. Have a condiment with it. Do not try and eat it like I just did. You know like when you go around your mother's house and she's not very good at cooking and she massively, massively overcooks the turkey. And then you're sat there, you're having to eat it. And no matter how much gravy you pour into it, when you chew it in your mouth, it feels like a desert. It is dry like you're, you're processing sawdust. That's what those taste like. Wow. I can't believe the one pound burger is probably gonna be the best thing I'm eating today. The buns are toasted and very hot. Ouch. The burger is nuked. Let's put them together. I would advise wearing gloves or something if you're doing this. Just because my skin doesn't burn easily when things come out of the microwave. Doesn't mean yours won't. It's not some superpower, it's just called not touching it for very long. If you've ever worked in a kitchen, and I have when I was much younger, you learn exactly how long it's going to take something to burn you. And then you avoid touching anything for that long. There we go. And certain temperatures will burn you immediately, of course. Most of them will. Looking pretty good. Too hot to eat for a couple of seconds, but doesn't look too far off the picture. Apart from the fact that the burger is half the size of the one in the picture. Can you see the difference? <sighs> Thumbnail. <laughs> Don't know if you can see that, but yeah, you're very hard pushed to find the bun. But I mean, look at this picture. It's absolutely ludicrous. There's no way it's going to look like that. Again, 
not bad tasting. Mm. Much better than these damn things. British sawdust and stuffing pastry. You can tell Sainsbury's aren't very proud of it when their name is the smallest piece of text on the packaging. Bad Sainsbury's. Good Asta. Yeah, this burger, again, does exactly what it says. It is a burger. I have no idea how they justify those photos. They make the packaging to, so to suit the bun. They should make the bun fit the burger and make the packaging smaller. That would make more sense. I wonder if these will get worse if I heat them up. Turkey gets drier the longer you cook it. They could go from bad to truly awful very quickly. Interesting challenge. Well, thanks for watching. This has been Bad Food Blog. I've had the British turkey and stuffing pasties from Sainsbury's and the Feaster's Cheeseburger £1 special, which for a quid is okay. Not bad, not good. Just it's a £1 burger. I would have preferred to have had any burger from uh, McDonald's though. Truly a bad food there. Please like the video and subscribe.